Well, it is back to school for many South Florida kids and a group of primary age students recently got a special lesson in marine science by joining a research team studying sharks in our ocean. Lucky them. It comes at a time when shark populations worldwide are sadly under a threat and engaging these young minds is key if we're going to save our sharks in the future. Louis Gary has tonight's Don't Trash Our Treasure. They are the most misunderstood creatures of the sea. I really like them, but I'm just afraid of them. Feared and maligned by many. <laughs> are you afraid of sharks? Yes. Unaware of how important they really are to all life on the planet. Ever since I've watched Jaws, I'm like, yeah, I'm not going in the water. And these young kids are about to have their first close-up encounter with a real live shark. And it kind of scares me. All right. We're on board the American Dream with the science team from Nova Southeastern University. So that one gets put on the fin of the shark. They're taking us on a shark tagging expedition off the coast of Hollywood Beach. We cast 10 baited drum lines into the sea. When the shark gets to the back of the boat, we'll tell you to let go. This is our classroom, and Dr. Derek Burkholder has quite the lesson planned. <laughs> It's always amazing to see what we catch. In less than an hour, we pull up our first catch. It's a sandbar shark, and it's the kids themselves who help tag it. Six, five, five. Good job. And measure it. 199 total. Something that some people are scared of, but when you see them in this context, it really changes the mind completely around. It's gold skin. It's just so pretty. It just made me like them more. More than just a cool experience for these kids, this is a legit research expedition and important data is being taken from each shark caught to help scientists determine how healthy our shark population is here in South Florida. We're looking at seasonal patterns, we're looking at their diets, we're even looking at their genetics to see how they fit in with other populations of sharks around the world. After the data was taken, the sandbar shark was quickly released, but soon after... Yes! It's an eight-foot nurse shark. These young Jacques Cousteau's and Sylvia Earls get back to work. Number is 693. The program is part of Guy Harvey Institute's Save Our Seas Shark Research Center. Awesome. Scientists regularly invite kids and educators to join them to underscore the critical role sharks play in keeping our oceans healthy. Sharks are so very important in our ecosystems. They help balance our marine ecosystems out. Since 1970, global shark populations have declined by more than 70%. And right now, humans are killing over 100 million sharks a year, driven by the insatiable fin market. So when we're taking that many out, we are doing massive damage uh, to our, our oceans worldwide. It's an important lesson for these young conservationists, students from Surf Skate Science, a homeschooling and after-school STEM program. We're exposing them to a, a great career in marine science, but also getting them to really love sharks and to learn about sharks in a, in a real way. An experience these young minds won't soon forget. Oh, it's a tiger! It's a tiger! tiger. It's a tiger shark! Over 12 feet long, she's gorgeous and made quite the impression. And it felt cool. Yeah? Yeah. How do you feel about sharks now? I love them. <laughs> They're awesome. I love sharks so much. Yeah? They're awesome. It's amazing what can happen when you confront your fears. Just like that, young shark advocates were born that day. They're a part of the ocean. We don't want to hurt them or do anything to them. Yeah. This is their home. We just love them. And despite anecdotal reports of increased shark sightings and incidents of shark stealing catch from anglers, scientists push back and say South Florida's shark population is not where it should be. Populations of reef sharks globally have declined by up to 73% over the past 50 years. That's why research expeditions like this are so important. NSU regularly hosts these educational opportunities for students of all grades and ages. We have that link for you as well as more information on the Surf Skate Science Program. Just scan that QR code. It'll take you straight to the Don't Trash Our Treasure page on Local10.com. I'm Louis Aguirre, Local 10 News.